Hey guys, what's up? It's Breezy and welcome back to House Party. Last time we beat the murder mystery and now it's time to do what I want to do, which is hook up with whoever, however, whenever. Yeah. Oh, she left. Bye. Okay. I definitely didn't fart. So if you smell anything, no, it's definitely not me. Oh my God, Patrick, this is not you censored. Case with you when you showed up. Oh my God, I forgot to put those censors back on. When did I ever take the censors off? You may ask. Okay, where's Brittany? Someday. Hey, girl. Dearest Mama and Pop. Hey again. How's it going? Um. Hmm. So we're in the friend zone right now, so I need to still like build up our friendship. I can probably train somebody to be if I was properly motivated. I can't see that happening though. As a matter of fact, I am. There is one cutie I've had my eye on for a while, but I'm not quite sure if that's going anywhere yet. She happens to be here tonight. Our little secret. Maybe if I work up the courage, I can make some progress there. Oh. Tell me more about this secret someone you have your eye on. Oh, it's just a crush, really. I don't even know if it'll develop into anything more. Who knows if she even feels the same way? Aww. It's probably more of a dream than ever becoming a reality. But it's okay to dream, right? Yeah, it is. Oh, I'm just a mess, honestly. I'm the epitome of looking for love in all the wrong places. Once I joined a doomsday cult just to get closer to somebody I had my eye on, but between the hunts and the sacrificial rituals, I didn't even have a chance to try. And since then, I've been trying to figure out what I'm really looking for. You know, before the world ends. Just kidding. Man, those people were batshit. That's kind of crazy. Um, some advice from a friend, maybe open yourself up and let your heart lead. What if my heart is feeling something towards another woman? What if I feel like there's this meadow in my soul that is begging for me to frolic in, but there's a storm lingering on the horizon, and if I go outside, it'll start to thunder and downpour, and then there's a giant earthquake and a tsunami at the same time, and I'm hurtled 400 feet in the air only to plunge back in the water and drown. This Ugh, is like sorry. some... I got a little carried away. I sound like I belong in the loony bin now. I just can't keep my head straight thinking about all this. My emotions are everywhere. Confidence, Brittany, confidence. Sounds like Final Destination episode, honestly. Um. Hmm. Okay. Okay. I think we warmed <gasps> up. Oh, God. Sorry. I didn't mean to do whatever I just did. I really gotta stop doing that. Do I still have my. Okay. <laughs> you ever heard of neighborhoodwatch.com, brah? Just go ahead and take a look if you get the chance. <laughs> I'm so drunk, brah. I love a man who can dance. Hmm. hmm, let's see what we can talk to you about. Um, have you heard of anything about Brittany having a crush on someone? Brittany's got a crush at the party? Wait, wait, hold up. Give me a second to visualize Brittany hooking up with somebody here at the party with those massive melons of hers. Mmm. Okay, bear with me, bra. Now one more sec while I think about that person being yours truly. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Thoughtgasm. And there's your answer. It's obviously me. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to go clean my pants. And then I might try to chat Ms. Brittany up. You got this, Patrick. What a fuck? I can literally just say that? What do you think he's gonna say? Well, he's not interested. I'm gonna go ahead and stop you right there. Should I do it? I've gotta take a shit. Whoa, brah, do my ears deceiveth me? Or did you just ask me to fuck? I'm just double checking because I don't want a repeat of the infamous skating rink incident. It took weeks for those rollerblade marks on my face to go away. Well, in that case, what do you say we make our way to Madison's bedroom? If she thinks she hates it when I watch porn on her bed, she's really gonna hate me having sex on it. Holy shit, am I really gonna have sex? I'll meet you there, Pat. Yeah, I'm a slut. That. I'm all about women. Bro. Don't need no Mission hook up with everyone in this house is on its way. All right. Ooh, do I need to lock this door? Do I have? 
I feel like I... Patrick! Patrick! Seem kind of weird. Oh, he's drunk. It's not even... Hmm. Okay, well, you know what? We're trying. We're trying real hard here. This has got to be the worst decision I have ever had. <laughs> do I do it? Do I do it? Do we hook up? You're not sober. How is this gonna go? I'm so drunk, brah. Ready to hook up? Actually, brah, I have one teeny tiny request first. You seem like a pretty open-minded chick, and that's exactly the kind of chick I like. Well, besides the one that are a pain in my ass, because I am a sucker for some good old-fashioned emotional abuse. Which brings me to my point of asking if you would like to be the open-minded kind of bra that is willing to be a literal pain in my ass. You get my drift, bra? Like, with a strap-on, sex style, in my ass? I believe the term is pegging, and I swear I don't know that from searching the internet for ass insertion. <laughs> Holy shit, are you some kind of like sex genie? What bottle of lube did I rub to get so lucky? <laughs> well, all right, my beautiful bra, let's get to the festivities. Let's do it, bra. Whoa, what did I see? Party! <laughs> No way. There's no way. <laughs> There's no way. <laughs> no. There's no. No. There's no way. Oh, it's so bad. This is so bad. No way. I like don't even know how to describe how uncomfortable that was. That was uncomfortable. I would rate that scene a 2 out of 10. All right, let's go to the next person. Depending on how often I masturbate, obviously. Obviously. I think there's a water. How's it going, lady, dude? Staying um, away from the alcohol? Hmm. There's so many things I can say right now. Hold on. Frank, I overheard somebody saying that they have alcohol. What do we do? Holy shit. I tell you what we gotta do. We gotta conduct ourselves a sting operation. Here's the plan. I'll give you a head start, and then I'll come and find you in one minute. See if you can get whoever it is to confess about having some alcohol on them when I walk by, and then I'll take it from there. If not, I'll just go back on patrol. We're better safe than sorry. We can't risk any alcohol in the hands of these wackos. Who knows what they'll do? Sounds like a plan. Let's do it. Oh! I'm so drunk, bruh. Uh-huh. What the fuck, dude? I'm gonna beat the fucking shit out of you. Oh, where's my popcorn? Oh. Oh. oh my god. Oh, his neck! Yeah, it's about to show that pencil neck, beady eyed, Tom and Bahama dropout, child molesting looking motherfucker. What kind of a monster wears full length tropical shirts, anyhow? <laughs> oh my god. Well, I'm not gonna pick that up. Time to compliment my enormously juicy, dangling man berries. <laughs> you don't have to be coy. I saw you eyeing the outline pressing against my shorts. No, 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 no. They're not as big as you think. 
I lack adorable. Can I have a smooth Just seeing how long you do not Yeah. Even the so new well. girl is having fun. I can dance all night, well, Brittany. Well, if I'm being honest, I really haven't had too many relationships. You're about I'm to have one with me. Open to things. You better be open to me. I prefer women over men, though, if you catch my drift. Oh, I catch it all right. Host of the party. I'm catching the, the feeling. Hey again. How's it going? Um, I'm just gonna be honest. Oh, honey, you're making me blush. I've never actually been with another woman before, though. And I want it to feel right, you know? Swept up in the moment, eyes locked, hands on hips. I'd have to be sure, especially because we're friends. Mama always told me that friends are like apple pies. They're wonderful to have around, but once you put them in your mouth, they're gone forever. I don't know, maybe she's wrong in this case, but either way, I'd have to be sure. Sorry, I thought I heard someone dying. Anyways, give me a chance that I can show you something special. Well, actually, darling, I have to admit, I've been keeping an eye on you tonight since you got here, and it made me realize what a good person you can be. Me? Oh, really? What did you like? You gave that nice mentally challenged boy some medicine to help with his headache. I gave him it's some other things to care too. For in need, even if they are a bit different. Continue. I've still got my eye on you, but I feel like things are on the right track. I love seeing this caring, thoughtful side of you. It just does things to my heart. It does a lot to my heart too. Thanks, Brittany. All the alcohol and put it in this cabinet so I can keep watch. How's it going, lady, dude? Um, Staying away from the alcohol. Do you and your sisters get into your PJs and have pillow fights and then start rolling around? Frank, I'm ready for glory. Will you accept my help now? Sorry, dude. But I don't trust you enough. Maybe if you could best I could. Alright, so I need to get going, lady, some dude. trust. Staying away from the alcohol. I swear though, um missing. I better not find out anybody's been stealing shit. Hmm. Look, dude, if there's a chance there's alcohol in that there thermos, I need to take that very seriously. I can't check it myself because just the smell of alcohol makes me sick. I could check it for you. Not for nothing, dude, but I don't know you well enough. Maybe if you could prove to me that you could be trusted. I'll do my best, Frank. What if I gave you... Holy shit, dude. I must have missed this when I was going around scooping up all the alcohol. I'm glad you see things the same way I do. I'll take this off your hands. Just do my oh part, boy. Frank. Okay, really so I'm just gonna booze. go. Ooh, shoot, I guess he's got to celebrate the small things in life. Whoa, dude. Where'd you find that? Thanks for bringing this to my attention. Just do my yeah. part, Frank. Okay, so I'm gonna go on a hunt to find all these alcohol bottles, and then that way Frank trusts me. Cause so, in the past, like Frank, you can romance him, but like. It normally was with a guy. So I'm wondering with a girl what it would be. You know? I'm just curious. There's nothing wrong with him. Well, right. clinically speaking at least. He's just a lucky bastard who struck gold by peddling news on the internet at the right time. He wouldn't even be here if it wasn't for my freaking aunt writing me and Madison Catherine about it all the time. Is it beautiful? Is this bird beautiful? Gosh, it is so dark in here. There's no stopping me. All right, let's just keep on looking. Man, that is making a whole lot of noise. Open. Ooh, what's that? Chardonnay? Chardonnay? You don't say. Alright. I just don't know how many bottles there are, you know? I still don't know what that is. Oh, can I put on this sundress? Can I wear this sundress? No, of course not. Because why? I have to wear my little crop top. It's cute. I like it, you know, but... Could just be better, you know? Alright, Frank, I'm gonna give you some stuff. Oh, not the flashlight. Shit, another one? You, sir, 
a uh, great asset to my I know I'm amazing actually shit another one you yeah I'm great I'm also gonna give you this Chardonnay holy fuck I must have missed this thanks for looking out for me dude I really appreciate it yeah no problem how's it going lady dude staying away from the alcohol <sighs> do you trust sorry, me sorry dude fuck but I don't trust you enough Oh my Life. God. When I die, I want I them I to preserve to my brain bottle. in VR, just like in that Tom okay. Cruise movie. How's it going, lady, dude? Staying away from the alcohol? Mm. Mm. Holy shit. I tell you what we got. Drink in like 10 minutes. Okay. I'm telling you, there's something sinister about I'm so drunk, brah. Ah, the lady. Well, in that case. All right, come on, come on, come on. I need you to come up here so I can have you get knocked out. It's. You thought we're going for round two, but really, I'm. Um, we're going for round two, if you know what I mean. Ding ding! Oh, I didn't see this up here. Yep, yep, yep. I'm so drunk, bruh. Um. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, I'd like to run into Rachel with my dick, if you know what I mean. You don't even know what you mean, Whatever. man. So, what did Rachel have to say about moi? Wait, what did Rachel say about bra? <laughs> nice, Patrick killed it. Wait, are you... Did Rachel really say that? Yeah, Seems she totally said she likes you. Frank! In the face. Frank, he has the alcohol out, Frank. Yeah, she's probably expecting a hug from you ASAP. Get the heck out of here! This is fantastic! I'm gonna give her a big old bear hug. I hope my boner's not too bravious. It's definitely not. I'm so drunk, bruh. Frank, do you hear that? The fuck, dude? I'm gonna beat the fucking shit out of you. Oh, here Whoa. we go. Whoa! Ooh, Bro. ooh. Oh! Oh man. Hmm. Alright, bye Frank. I need you to leave so I can pick up this bottle of alcohol. <gasps> Is it true that dinosaurs roamed the earth only 64 years ago? Hee hee hee. Alright. Frank, you're not gonna believe all the stuff I got. Get ready. What's your nickname? Holy shit, dude. I must have missed this when I was going around scooping up. You did, you did. Holy shit, dude. Holy shit, dude. Shit, another one? Shit. You. Holy shit, Holy. dude. I must have missed this. Holy. Holy shit, dude. Holy shit. I must have missed this. Whoa, no. Dude. Where'd you find that? My hand hurts from all the alcohol. Shit, another one? You, sir, are a great asset to my cause, and your loyalty to me is noted. Good, I'm glad. I think I got it all. How's it going, lady, dude? Staying away from the alcohol? Come on, Frank, stealing from girls. Look, dude, if there's a chance there's alcohol in that there thermos, I need to take that very seriously. I can't check on myself because just the smell of alcohol makes me sick. I could always... Check You've for you. proven yourself to me, dude. I trust you to make the right decision. Go ahead. Take a whiff. If there's Sounds like a plan. If there's any alcohol, look at all this Rachel, alcohol. Rachel, thanks so much for seeing the light. Now come here. It's time for me to give you a classic patty two-arm squeeze. Let's go nips to nips, brah. Oh, boy. That should be good. Get the fuck off of me. My body is a weapon. Oh. That's usually his M.O. I've been trying my hand at some of those battle royals. It reeks of booze. Hey, asshole. I see you with that booze. You're dead. No, no, no! Frank! 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 Fuck, I need to save. Save, save, save. Save the game. Uh, after alcohol. Frank. Frank. 
Frank! 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 Ooh! Bada bing! Ah, shoot! Oh, bang! Bang! A bang! Oh, I'm dead. Fuck! Fuck! So, if I load it to where I just did it. Is it gonna just load back to Frank trying to beat me? So I smelt it. So maybe I had to go back to him and tell him that there was no alcohol in it. Silly goose, I can't just take alcohol. I swear to God, if it's like, oh, you're fucking dead, bro. Oh. Oh. Self on display. I'm so drunk, bruh. When I try to show people what the fuck, dude. I'm gonna beat the fucking shit out of you. Whoa! Ooh. Oh, God dang. You got that dark under eyeliner, Frank? What are you looking at? Alright, well. I need that. And I'm gonna save. Yes, I'm gonna save right here. Really do get in the way of some martial arts poses. These are- How's it going, lady, dude? Staying away from the- I trust <laughs> I gave that, that you'll tell me the truth Smith. about the situation. Yeah, Leah was a kung fu fighting. Ooh. Her kiss leave them bitches crying. Do I- Should I tell him the truth? Is he gonna be interested in me? You did the right thing today. Don't you ever forget that. The thermos stays Frank. with me, but you've gained my everlasting trust. I will, You just let Frankie. me know if you ever need a solid. Thanks, Frank. I have to say, I've been enjoying your visits over to the security headquarters of the house. It's been making my balls tingle in a different way, if you get my drift. That's all I I'm going to say for now. You can let that marinate for a bit, but uh, keep it up. Oh, I will. Frank, I will. How's it going, lady, dude? Uh, Staying away from the alcohol? Mm, I'm ready for glory. Will you accept my help now? Hmm. As much as I trust you, you just don't have the balls for this. I could, if, uh, I could hold my own. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I don't mean it in a figurative sense. I mean my balls are massive, dude. You literally don't have the balls for it. What an observation. Hey, it's not like that. I'm just calling it like I see it. Anyway, I've been working out my scrotum, taking ball supplements and getting testicular injections for years. Years? To get this look. Injections? My balls? Are a fucking work of art. Also, my sack's special abilities have just started to surface. Oh? But with these babies pumping me up with a best buster on, the potential is endless, though. Oh, it's a thing. Two huge, massive things. Trust me. I'm sure you're already aware as to how having huge fucking balls comes with all kinds of obvious benefits and perks by itself, but when they really get massive, they straight up start acquiring superpowers, dude. Superpowers. There's a whole Discovery Channel special about it. Mm. You should check it out. Okay. How's it going, lady, dude? Hmm. Staying away from the alcohol? I'm trying to think of how... I'm not saying I don't Leah? Oh yeah, she's my apprentice. She's a good kid. I invited her along as backup tonight. I've even got her calling me sensei. When we met, she saw what a badass I was, and she was impressed with my martial arts skills. I bet she was. She's trying to open up her own studio or some shit. Good it's to cute. know. Weird feeling tonight, cute. Like I've... How's it going, lady, dude? I'm just trying to see. What do I gotta do? Um. Different outcomes. I guess that should be 
I don't think having big balls matters as much as you think. Oh, wow. Oh, really? I mean, I knew you were a little green, but uh, I didn't know you were that inexperienced. The simple fact of the matter is that ladies just love a man with a huge set of balls. Okay. The bros do too. Fucking everybody does. They can't get enough of them. There ain't nobody out there who isn't impressed by the size of my fucking Jolly Ranchers, dude. Aren't Jolly or Ranchers jealous, small? I'm being honest. Well, because I, uh, set up a lot of surveillance systems in my line of work, and I, uh, I constantly overhear people talking to each other and bragging about how big their respective boyfriends and fuck buddies' balls are. Let's keep that between you and me, though. Those systems aren't, uh, exactly legal. You get what I'm saying. Yeah, I hate to break it to you, but they're not talking about... <laughs> God. <laughs> what does a chick really know about the power and majesty of the balls? People have known that balls are the hottest shit on the fucking planet for, like, ever. Why else would that guy from the 50s with the bouncy hair literally write a song about hot fucking balls, dude. I'm gonna ask around Go the party. These people know the real strength of a man is in the size of his gentle sailors. Now All right. that's... I guess the bra isn't coming. Yeah, she probably just got tied up with something. No. With the dancing thing? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm so drunk, bruh. Uh -huh. the fuck, dude? I'm gonna beat the fucking shit out of you. Whoa! Oh, yikes. I just want everything to be oh. tonight and for everybody to get oh. oh oh <laughs> no not the lamp not the lamp god my boyfriend is in the doghouse for sure <laughs> that's just nuts hello again Oh, yeah, I guess I have been kind of spacing out. Well, it's just that I'm new in town and I'm trying to join a sorority. They got me doing a scavenger hunt as an initiation. Ooh. It's due tomorrow and I don't have a lot of the items still. I'm thinking about maybe leaving the party and seeing if I can finish it up. A lot. I oh, can wow. help. Okay then, maybe I'll stick around for a bit and see what we can get accomplished. Thank sure thing. Hello again. Let me, give me a scavenger Let's list see. item. The first item I don't have is... Oh gosh, somebody's expired credit card and he- Leave it to me. I think there was one in the office. Why can I not move? Oh my gosh. I think there was one in here. Yeah. All right. Well, that's one item. All kinds of things lying around everywhere that I didn't get a Amy, to put away. You were just here. Gosh, girl. Give credit card. Oh, wow. That was so nice of Madison to let you have her old credit card. I'm real She's the best. She totally the fire is so pretty. What's okay. another scavenger? So, next item? up I need Oh gosh, I need to get a condom from a stranger. If this is too embarrassing for you, you can let me know and I'll understand. I think I'd die if I had to do this myself. I got this. Um, I actually don't know how I'm gonna do that. Do I have anything in my inventory? I have a head. Hmm, condom. I don't know where I'm gonna get that, but we'll figure something out. I guess Derek really wanted to bring his friend along to my party tonight. Is it me? Or is it rude to extend a How's it going, lady, dude? Staying away from the alcohol? Hmm. Is that chair uncomfortable? It looks uncomfortable. Fuck, dude, I know. And it doesn't help that my huge man's glands keep getting pinched and squished, squashed between my thighs every time I try to shift around. Really love what your mama gave it, I don't shouldn't you? complain, though. I mean, everybody knows what the perks are of having such massive milk and honeys. It's hard to pretend like the positives don't outweigh the negatives. 
-hmm. It's a blessing and a curse, I suppose. But some say a man's ultimate worth and expected overall happiness in life is correlated with the size of his... All right. You know... How's listen. it going, lady, dude? Staying away from the alcohol? Do you have a condom Holy I can fuck, have? Holy fuck, Frankie, it's happening. Your balls are working their magic. <sighs> no way. Sure, baby. I've got a condom right here. No way. You looking to take a ride to Frankie's fuck palace? Chucka, 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 chucka. Dude, dude. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Frankie's fuck palace. Chugga chugga doo dude. I I just don't Oh, I see what's going on here. <laughs> Faced with the magnitude of my manliness, you're feeling a bit overwhelmed. I get it. It happens all the time. Thanks. Thanks, Frank. Oh god. I'm doing a really good job with this scavenger hunt. Oh wow, thank you. I don't even want to know how you got this. It's better you don't ask. Really. Dude, you don't get it. She's right. so pretty. The fire is so pretty. I hmm. get it. Let's see. Oh, here's one I don't have yet. I need to convince my closest male friend to take his shirt off and give it to me. That would be Derek out of everybody who's here. He's really shy. I doubt you'd be able to get him to do it. Oh, I'll figure something out. Derek! I need your shirt! You see how Steph stepped up to help Amy? She doesn't even know that chick. Pretty cool of her. Yeah. Um, you mess anything ever happened there? What? You must be out of your mind, man. Me and Okay, my bad. My bad. Oh, hey, what's up, girl? Um What the fuck? Why would I do that? I don't want a repeat of 8th grade gym class when everybody said I had french fry nipples. Nah, sorry. I don't think anybody here wants to see that. Until proven otherwise, the shirt stays on. I saw... A petition. A petition. For me to take my shirt off? Okay, you've got my attention. Show me this petition and maybe we'll talk. I'll get back to you. He when the horse dies for... Hey again, how's it going? Oh gosh. Well, I never. What kind of a question is that to ask a lady? Frank made me ask. Frank, is that true? Did you make this poor girl ask me such a rude question? Yeah, Frank. Huh? What? Me? I mean, yeah, I did, but but it's not like that. Look, we're not trying to be rude. We're just trying to settle a bet. This chick thinks that all women prefer big cocks over big balls, and while she's entitled to her stupid opinion, I'm just trying to show her that she's dead wrong and stupid. Man, say that again, please. Well, that is certainly an interesting argument you two have got going on. I'm not quite sure why you need my input on it. But if you really want to know, Frank, I hate to break it to you, but I think you've been misled. Now, me, personally, I'm mostly attracted to women. While I do like to dabble with men from time to time, I think balls are rather disgusting, if you ask me. I wish men came in a variety with just the penis and no balls. Now that would be a dream come true. Dream come true. Well, anyway, I think I've said more than enough and I don't care to elaborate. You two have fun. Okay, thanks. Hey, wait. This doesn't make any sense. I knew that lesbo chicks didn't like balls, but I thought the only reason for that was because they had never seen a respectable pair before. You're into boobs, right? I mean... Those are just basically huge balls with nipples on them. Are you picking up what I'm putting down here? That's not really how all that works, Frank, but I have better things to do than argue with you. I'll just leave you alone to wrestle with those demons in your head. Burn. Point for me, Frankie. Oh, do to see. Hey again. How's it going? Yes. Sorry, but what the fuck? Let's try a different topic of conversation, at least until we're on better terms. Okay. When I came to oh my gosh. Hey again. We have How's to get on going? better terms. Um. I keep getting this really um, like I've been here before. Ever since I was young, she's okay. always been rolling pranks on me and embarrassing. Please, please, please don't bring up that bullshit to me. It makes me sick to my stomach how full of shit my sister can be. I have no control over what she <laughs> Do you see now? Oh, low bro, Ash. Don't word it like that. 
You She's not crazy. She's just <laughs> enjoying your little trash talk. Oh, wow. Okay, I again. skipped through How's a lot of stuff. Um, how about... And that was a really gross thing you said, Patrick. Really fucking gross. Sorry, but... What? Damn, Auntie C. Patrick, the freight. Just go up there and tell her we're sorry. That's a big 10-4, Ash. Good luck. Wow, I don't know what I just hey, did. Again. How's it going? I was just trying to... Well, I doubt Madison would ever... You're sweet. I'm here if you have any questions about the crowd, including yours. Sorry, but... What the... Oh my gosh, how hey much How's sooner... Mm. Mm. Ugh, please no. don't compare me to her. I tried. Yikes. My bad. Frank, fight. I'm so drunk, brah. Oh, God. Did you hear that? I seriously have half of a mind to disappear into Madison's art room and just ah. get bitched for the rest of the night. Maybe if I keep smoking. Hey, again. How's it going? Mm. I have no idea. Just so you know, Madison will. I'm just saying. Hey again, how's it going? We've got all sorts here. I can't. Well, like, mm. I don't know who you've met and who you haven't. Aw, that's really sweet of you. Hey again, mm. how's it going? Sorry, but. What the fuck? <sighs> you should come in, come, come closer. Come closer, Amy. Amy, come closer. Amy, come, come closer. Amy, Amy, keep walking, keep walking, keep walking, Amy. Amy, Amy. Amy, push you. And talk. Hello again. Whoa, 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 slow down. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I don't think we're close enough to have this conversation. Maybe try to soften a girl up before you go for a deep dive into my sexual preferences. You're telling me I've done all these scavenger hunt things for you and you don't want to tell me what you prefer? All right, Come Amy. Come on, Amy. It's just a friendly squabble between two friends. This Neanderthal thinks a large penis is preferable in a sexual partner while myself an intellectual okay i am not having this conversation with either of you right now i'm gonna go find something else i'm a business genius wait isn't that what you had i'm so drunk what the fuck dude i'm gonna beat the f i'm so drunk bruh oh my god madison let me use the bathroom in her upstairs bedroom and i saw her phone just lying there on the sink i wonder if she even knows she left it there hey how's it going well, I mean, nobody should be insecure about their size of their anything. But from a woman's standpoint sexually, I think big balls would just get in the way rather than do anything for me. So I'll have to go with the penis. You shut your mouth, Rachel. You don't know anything. You haven't lived until you've had a huge pair of balls inside of you. I, what? Um, I'm gonna go now. Point for me, point for Gryffindor. How's it going, lady dude? Look at Stay that. Stay away from the alcohol. You mean with the few people you managed to manipulate into saying that shit in front of me? <sighs> we need to relax. I feel like I've done a lot this time. I'm just gonna sit down and enjoy. And look at what we have to do. Cause we have so much to do. We have so much. All right, guys, that is the end of this episode for House Party. We are slowly working our way to get Frank on our side, and that way we can romance him. I feel like a lot of pieces are in play, and next time around, it may be a good time. It may be a really good time. But I hope you guys are enjoying this series, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye. Ah! Holy shit, dude. Frank. Slap in the face. Frank, he has the alcohol out, Frank. No, 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 Frank, 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 Frank. Chucka, chucka, chucka. Do, do.